After downloading point clouds for SOLIDWORKS from our website, www.vsys.com. Double click on the installer and accept the software license agreement. Click next to continue. Default or previous installation directory is shown, although you may alter this location. Click next to continue. At the component screen select the version of the add-in required. If you do not have Visual C++ redistributable installed or very first installation you can select that here too. Click next. At the ready to installed screen click install once happy with the setting selected. Installation is very quick, shown here in real time. Once installation is complete, click finish. Now load the version of SOLIDWORKS that you have just installed the add-in for. Demonstrated was the installation of the add-in for SOLIDWORKS 2023. The VSYS add-in will now load and require your username and password to be entered. Once entered select login. SOLIDWORKS will now continue to load. Once loaded select the options pull-down menu, followed by add-ins. Scroll to the bottom of the add-ins window until the section Other add-ins is listed. Note VSYS point clouds for the version you have installed is correct. This should match the version of SOLIDWORKS you are using. Make sure the options are ticked as shown. Click OK. To load a point cloud first add a part or assembly. Move over to the VSYS tab, select the green plus symbol. The options for local and network are displayed. The important part to note is that local is for users with a professional license, and benefit from having clouds that will display faster and smoother is not dependent on internet connection. Shown here is the professional version selecting local. You can change the drive directory location and also use the shift and control keys to select more than one cloud file as per Windows File Explorer. Once selected click open. The point cloud or clouds should be displayed near instantly, but if not using local files with a professional version, the streaming and display speed from Zapcha Cloud will be reliant on your internet connection. Select the point cloud in the list and click the zoom icon and the views will center on the point cloud. Shown here is enabling color from the render options, opacity and adjusting the quality.